Covering news where you live. Five News starts with breaking news. Breaking news, the details on that audit for the $19,000 lectern purchased by the Arkansas governor's office. For months, legislators have poured over documents related to that purchase. Then in October, lawmakers voted to audit that purchase, which has drawn questions and scrutiny over its costs and the public records surrounding it. Five News reporter Rachel Williams has the latest now on what today's report is revealing. If you remember back in October, lawmakers voted to audit the purchase, which has drawn questions and scrutiny over its cost and public records surrounding it. Now the Arkansas Legislative Audit Committee is releasing the report on the lectern purchase. According to the report, the committee found seven areas of potential noncompliance with state law. The report notes that the payment for the podium before it was delivered resulted in a potential violation of state code. The report also notes that the bill of lading was shredded by a member of the governor's office staff, a potential violation of requirements for document retention. The auditors also found that three versions of the Beckett events invoice, two of which contained a handwritten notion to be reimbursed. The report states that executive assistant to the governor's office, deputy chief of staff, made the handwritten note, altering public record after it was submitted by the governor's office. According to the audit, prior to the FOIA request related to the podium purchase, there was no indication that the governor's office was seeking reimbursement for the cost of the podium and road case. We spoke to state lawmakers ahead of the report's release. You know, there was nothing unethical about it, right? The, the governor wanted to buy a piece of furniture that happened to be expensive, but it's something that she was going to hopefully use for eight years. That $19,000 for a lectern that I'm not sure has been used once since its purchase, I think is just absolutely egregious, um, regardless of whether or not any rules were broken. Uh, it certainly seems uh, <laughs> like a gross misuse of taxpayer funds. Now we reached out to the governor's office for a statement after the report was released. Alexa Henning, the governor's spokesperson, says, quote, The facts outlined in the report demonstrate what the governor's office said all along. We followed the law and the state was fully reimbursed with private funds for the podium at no cost to the taxpayers. We have posted the results of the audit online. If you want to look through it yourself, just head over to 5newsonline.com for the latest updates. Rachel Williams, 5 News.